Hello everyone, this is Elise from Plan About It. I'm shooting this video to show you the different kits that I have available. Um, well, that I will have available on the 14th when my shop comes out of vacation. So these are the new releases, technically, because they are all new. The designs aren't new, but I have reformatted the kit. And I don't know if you just heard that, but my cat just walked in here. I left my door open and she took advantage of that. Yes, you did. Can you leave? I'd appreciate it if you would leave. Please? Thank you. No, you were leaving. I love you too. Goodbye. Oh, please, turd, get out. No, that's the opposite of out. Go. I'm sorry, turd. Okay. So let's try that again. Um, my shop is reopening on October 14th, and I will have in it five weekly kits of two different sizes. There's the deluxe size and the regular size. The deluxe size is seven sheets, and the regular is five sheets. And they're very similar. The deluxe, of course, comes with more. So I'm going to first show you just on this kit a detail of what comes on each page, and I'll show you the difference between the two sizes. And then I will show you the rest of the kits, and I'll just quickly flip through those. So I'm starting with my Peacock Glitter Weekly Kit, and I'm just going to start with the Deluxe because that's going to show you everything. And so I'm going to try to slide this off and save it so I can use it when I put this back together. So the kits themselves will come banded in a little paper strip with a sticker saying what size the kit is. Really. I mean, that's pretty packaging, but it's mostly just to help me keep track of inventory so I can quickly know what that is that I'm looking at. Alright, so the first sheet is the deco and quote box sheet. So you have the full box with the quote on it. The peacock says, why fit in when you were born to stand out? And then it's just got clip arts of all of these pretty flowers and peacocks for deco. You have your eight full boxes. And so you've got two peacocks, two peacock feathers, and then some monochrome boxes with flowers, peacocks, peacock feathers. And you've got at the bottom four labels or quarter boxes. And that's the full box sheet. This sheet is only available in the deluxe kit. In the... Um, Regular kit, these stickers for the sidebar and the payday and bill due, they do show up, but all of these stickers, the along the side here, all these icons, and the day covers are not in the regular kit. So this just has your teardrops and your page flags and this glitter. You've got your Monday through Sunday box here. And then you do have four habit trackers. It looks like one sticker, but when you peel it off, it is four different stickers. You have your payday stickers, bill due, and then all of these little icons, and each kit in the deluxe version has 20 icons and two little banners, and they're all decorated to match that kit's colors. So, it'll always match, and um, you've got also your day covers here. One of the biggest changes about my weekly kits that I made is that in order to make room for all of these cute icons, I'm calling them functional icons in the shop. But uh, to make room for all of them, I had to get rid of the 1 to 31 to put in the day covers. So you have to write in the number of the day now. Next, the other sheet that's only available in the full kit, in the deluxe kit, I should say is the ombre heart checklist. This kit has um, the glitter colors because this is the peacock glitter kit. And then the ombre heart checklist have your other four quarter boxes or labels. The next sheet has the heart banners. There's eight of those. There are 24 or 28? 28, 28 um, dots. And I made my dots a little bit bigger than they used to be, so they're just a little bit bigger than they were before. And I wonder if I'm going to be able to get that back straight. 
well this is my kit anyway for next week I have four appointment labels, your weekend banner, and all the weekend banners are going to be decorated with deco from the kit. And you have eight half boxes. The next sheet is going to be the washi sheet. And I just want to show you one thing that I changed about the washi strips is you've got one super thin strip, and then you've got two strips that are about header size and then you have one strip that's the size of a little thing. So you've got four strips in all of these colors and then four pattern strips. And then this one has, um, I think this is three that are header sized and then one that's a little bit smaller than a header and then that one really tiny one. That's the one that sits next to the bottom washi. And of course you have your two strips of bottom washi. All the kits I'm going to show you are printed on matte paper. Glossy is still going to be made to order and that's the main reason why my turnaround time on my shop is going to be one to three days because I'm not going to make any glossy right away. That will be made to order if you order glossy kits. All right, so here are your headers and little things. I decided to make all the little things the same color so that your row or your call, yeah, it is a row, your row of little things, wherever you put it in your spread, will match instead of having um, where you have four different colors of little things and then it's very difficult to try and match up the color with the color of all the other little things for that day. So I just made them all the same color. You've got hydration, meals, TV shows, alarms, grocery shopping, asterisks, hearts, and happy mail. And then you have all of your normal headers, and then at the top are your sidebar or different headers. And I stopped including blank headers on this sheet because the washi sheet has blank strips. Normally this will be just solid colors for the kit, but this kit is glittery, so there are no blank solid colors. And those are all of the sheets that are included in the deluxe kit. Um, I'm going to take out this sheet and I'm going to take out this sheet. So when I compare with the regular kit, I can show you what I did. Um, instead of just taking two sheets out and giving you um, four sheets from the deluxe kit, I actually made the regular kit have, I'm moving the light because it's getting dark. It keeps getting darker outside, so I'm trying to compensate by finding light. Anyway, what I was saying was that I, instead of just taking out two sheets and giving you four sheets from the deluxe kit, I redesigned things a little bit so that the regular kit wasn't just a small deluxe kit. It has a lot of things that I think you can use. So this is how the regular kit will come exactly like the deluxe kit except for the package band it says regular. And again, that's mostly just to help me when I'm sorting through inventory to know exactly what I have. The deco sheet and the full boxes are exactly the same as what I showed you in the deluxe kit. This sheet of the heart banners, icons, this is exactly the same as what was in the deluxe kit. And the washi is exactly the same as what was in the deluxe kit. This is the sheet that's different. I kind of took both of these sheets, the headers and little things, and then this sheet with the icons and um, sidebar stickers. So I made sure that you still had all your sidebar stickers, these up here. But in order to do that, I had to give fewer headers and fewer little things. So what you're missing from down here are the hydration stickers, there are less TV stickers, there are fewer Happy Mail stickers, and then the headers, there are much fewer of those sidebar headers, just this week work and aspirations. And you also don't have eight of each of the normal headers like you do on the deluxe kit. In the deluxe kit, you have eight to-dos, eight todays, and eight this and that's. And the reason why you have eight of each instead of seven is so you can choose which color you only use once. But in this, it's kind of chosen for you that whatever color ends up in this last column is the color that you only use once. And just like on the deluxe kit, the um, 
Habit Tracker stickers. It is four separate stickers instead of just one box of habits that it looks like. So that is the difference between the regular sized kits and the deluxe size kits. So I'm just going to put those kits back together really quickly. Um, I don't know why I'm so crazy about keeping it in the same order, but there's a certain order that everything goes in. And now I will show you just quickly going through the Halloween kit. This kit, I decided that I wasn't going to put it back up when my shop came out of vacation, but then it was pretty popular and I figured that enough people do scrapbooking in their um, rewind planners that maybe it's worth making a couple more. So I made two of the deluxe size and two of the regular size and that's all that's going to be available in my shop. And so you have your deco, you have full boxes, you have the fun icons with the date covers, sidebar stickers, and teardrops and page flags. You've got your ombre heart checklists. You have your heart banners, icons, weekend banner, appointment labels, and half boxes. You've got all of your washi, and this top row of washi in most kits is a solid color. The only reason the peacock one had glitter was because that's the peacock glitter kit. And then you have your headers and little things. And that is the deluxe kit for the Halloween. I'm just going to put those back. And the deco, the quote box on this just says trick or treat, which I thought was adorable because of all the little trick or treaters in this kit. And then the regular kit is almost exactly the same. I feel like maybe I shouldn't even show the regular kits of these, but I'm going to anyway. So you've got your deco, you have your full boxes, your heart banners, icons, weekend banner, appointment flags, and half boxes. It's a lot of things on that sheet. And your washi, headers, little things, and sidebar stickers. And that is the regular size Halloween kit. I don't know if I mentioned pricing yet. The price of the deluxe kits is going to be $19.95. And the price of the regular kits is going to be $14.95. And the glossy upgrade for the kits is going to be, I believe, $4 for the deluxe kits and $2 for the regular. I might have that number a little bit wrong, but that is basically the pricing. This is the Autumn Animals kit, and the quote box just says, Hello Autumn, and you've got all the animals. This is from Kenesato Designs, Kenesato. I'm not sure how to pronounce her name, but... She has the clip art shop on Etsy where I got this clip art from. And then your full boxes. This clip art is from a different shop on Etsy. I don't remember the one, but I just thought it went really well with the colors from the animals. And so I picked it up and put this together. And then you've got all of your fun icons decorated to match the colors of the kit along with the sidebar stickers, date covers, teardrops, and page flags. You have your ombre heart checklists. You've got your heart banners, icons, weekend banner, appointment flags, and half boxes. Your washi sheet. And your headers and little things. And that is the deluxe kit of the autumn animals. And now the regular kit for the autumn animals. The same deco, the same full boxes, the same heart banners and icons. Oh, and on this one, 
Um, it's on all of the kits that I printed. That green border somehow got around the orange, but on all of them, thank goodness my silhouette is the best. <laughs> it worked very hard to make sure that it didn't mess up your sticker. It's not focusing, but there it goes. Even though that has a little bit of a whoops moment, it did cut out perfectly. Thank goodness. Where was I? Here's your washi sheet. And this bottom washi, oh, I love it. I worked kind of hard, longer than I want to admit, putting like this sunset kind of gradient in the background and then just arranging all of the little animals. And this one's my favorite, the uh, squirrel, I think. I think it's a squirrel. Maybe it's a beaver. I think it's a squirrel. It doesn't have teeth. The squirrel on the tree stump there is just adorable and you can see how tiny he is. There's my fingernail. And then you've got your headers, little things, and sidebar stickers. And that's the regular size of the Autumn Animals kit. Now we're going to get into my favorite kit I've ever made. And I know that it's not just my favorite because this one's the best selling kit on my Etsy store. It's the Coffee Chic kit. And this is the deluxe version of it. And now my light is um, cold for some reason. Like my lighting is colder than it is. Let me see if my hands make it. Yeah, now it's better. That's more true to the actual color, I think. But the quote box says, I am not a human before I have my coffee. And you have your sheet of deco there. I love this little mason jar full of carnations. I think it's carnations. You've got your full boxes here and labels your icons, and something about this color combination, pink, green, and brown, shows up over and over every time I'm trying to design anything. So pink, green, and brown just go together, and those are the only colors in the spectrum in my mind's eye. You've got your quarter box, or er, well, you do have quarter boxes, your ombre heart checklists here. And then this page full of all of these things, I'm not going to keep saying heart banners, icons, blah, 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 blah. And then your washi. On this kit and a, a few of my kits, I did decide to keep the bottom washi really simple and just kind of mix the watercolors together. But then sometimes I get a little bit more decorative with it. And you've got your headers and little things. So all the kits are really about the same except for the design of the boxes. And then of course the deco that's used. And then of course it just takes kind of a long time to recolor all of those icons. And here is the deco sheet for the regular kit, which is the same as the deluxe kit. The full boxes as well, the washi the icons and heart banners and half boxes, your headers. Now one lucky person, I'll talk about this, I didn't mean to pull this kit specifically, but as luck would have it, um, I accidentally printed two of this page more than I needed and instead of like holding on to it, I'm just giving it away. Some lucky person, well, two lucky people, will end up getting this with their regular kit. I'm not making any promises to anybody because I'm just packaging them up without paying much attention, and whoever gets it, gets it. Alright, and now I have my Ethereal Dreaming Kit, which I spelled incorrectly in my shop. I had no idea. But it's just got planets, crystals, the quote box is a Carl Sagan quote. It says, somewhere something incredible is waiting to be known your full boxes with the watercolors and then the ones on top have the crystals. Your fun icons and date covers with your sidebar stickers and financial stickers. You've got your ombre heart checks, your heart banners and icons, your washi sheets, and your headers and little things. So that's the deluxe kit. And the regular kit is here. 
I've got one more after this to show you. Did I say I had five kits? Because I think this has been six. I think this whole time I thought I had five kits, but I think I actually made six. Here are your deco and the quote box. You've got your full boxes, your heart banners and icons, your washi, and then your headers, little things, sidebar, and finance stickers. And the last deluxe kit is, again, this is another one that was not going to be making it back into my shop, but I am, because it was the summer into fall. This was supposed to be like the first kit you use in September or something like that. It was just the summer into fall kit but I am renaming it a touch of fall and keeping it around for a little bit longer. And the quote box just says, can you feel it? Fall is in the air on top of that watercolor background. And then these are tiny little deco. I made everything small so I could fit all of the animals in here and also make the laurels a bit big so that you can use it to really make something on your, in your box stand out. Like maybe I would put payday inside of this wreath. You've got your full boxes. These ones on top, I this is one of my favorite, favorite kits. But I just love these deer and then the begonias are really pretty too, but the raccoons in the like field of wildflowers. This is just one of my favorites. You've got your sheet of fun icons and all of that stuff. Your ombre heart check boxes, your heart banners and icons, your washi, and then this bottom washi, I kind of made the colors fade from one to another, all the colors from the kit. And then once again, here's the pink, green, brown. Always, always with the pink, green, brown. And you've just got um, all this washi here with the pattern. And then this one didn't get solid colors. It got watercolors because that's just what I decided to do. And then this washi right here, the top one is just blank. But then the leaves start coming in on the thicker washi. It just kept looking really strange for leaves to be on that really thin strip. So I kind of pushed them down a little bit. And then you've got your, this is the wrong, oh no, this is the right one. This is the, um, this is the deluxe kit. And then you've got your headers and little things. I thought I was already done, but just one more kit to show you. It's the same kit, but the regular size. So the Touch of Fall kit, formerly known as the Summer Into Fall kit. And the deco is the same. The full boxes are the same. The sheet of heart banners and icons and half boxes is the same. The washi is the same, but then again, the only difference between the sheets in the deluxe kit and this kit is that those two sheets in the deluxe kit kind of turn into this sheet with the headers and the little things with the sidebar boxes and the financial boxes. So that is everything. Those are all of my kits. You've got the, I'm just going to show the full boxes from each one and kind of recap. So you've got your Touch of Fall, and then you have your Ethereal Dreaming. You've got Coffee Chic. Oh, well, the full boxes don't really do this one much justice. So the autumn animals with your sheet of deco. And I gave a lot of big stickers with that one. And I tried to squish as much in there because that deco is just so cute. I do have to show you somewhere where I cheated. These two birds, all I did was I took this one, I flipped it around, and I used the paintbrush in uh, Photoshop mm -hmm. to give him open eyes. <laughs> So that is the Autumn Animals. Then you have the Trick or Treaters kit. Things are getting messy over here. The Trick or Treaters. 
is, what is that? That's one, two, three, four, five. Yes, I do have six. Holy moly. And then you've got your peacock glitter kit. And just because I think that that doesn't really show it off that great, I'm also going to show the glitter because these glitter ombre heart check boxes are making my day. And I am going to set this deluxe kit aside and use it myself. I am so excited for that. But anyway, those are the six, as it turns out, kits that will be in my shop on October 14th when it reopens. Um, and I think I'm only going to have a couple of each one. I know I have more of the Peacock and more of the Coffee Chic than the rest. Just because this one is brand spanking new. Nobody's ever seen this in my shop before. And this one was just so popular before I put the shop on vacation. So I've been working very hard. I am not printing and cutting any more weekly kits than this until the Friday after the shop opens. So I will see you guys next time. Um, my next video is going to show the monthly kits that I'm going to be coming out with. There will be two monthly kits. And since I'm opening the shop in October, but in the middle of October, I'm just going to do one November kit and one December kit now. And then with my first restock of November, I'm going to come out with more December. Um, I think one more December monthly kit. I'm going to do one that's like wintry and one that's holiday. All right. So thank you so much, guys, for watching. Have a great week. And I will see you probably in a week with those monthly kits.